What's up everyone? I'm gonna try to do a couple stories here. Uh, first run with the Rapid Change ATC. We got it all hooked up with Dawn. I still don't have the dust cover hooked up to it. Uh, waiting for CNC for Newbie to get that figured out with the pins. But I ran an air test and that was successful. So this is the first time trying to actually run anything. So we'll see if it works out. Okay, so here's the setup in V-Carve, a quick eighth inch drill mill for those holes and then a perimeter cut. So nothing fancy. Uh, I got the tool pass and the rapid change post processor set up. So let me run you through what uh, UCC and C looks like. All right, so here's UCC and C and you can see right here it says tool zero. So if you're not familiar or not using UCNC and C, it's kind of a pain. Um, you can see we have tool number five that's actually in the spindle now, but for whatever reason, the software, when you shut it down, it reverts back to zero. So what we have to do is tell the MDI what tool we have in right now, which is tool number five. So it's M61 T5 enter. And then you can see right here, it changes to tool five. And I want to touch on this real quick too, because this is super important. Um, so how this works with the tool setter, when you do your job setup, your material setup, you have to use some calipers to get the actual thickness of the material. And then you have to Z off of the machine bed, not material surface. So how this works, this tool setter is right here in pocket six. And you'll see, it'll go grab a tool, whatever tool, comes, picks it up, goes over here, hits the tool setter. That tool setter has been calibrated to meet the uh, machine bed here. And that might need slight calibration since I haven't done a full profile cut yet. So we'll see. I just want to make a notation on that.